I'm excited to learn about different kind of bees, because I know it was different kind of bees. Learning about them, trying to see what do they do, where do they really go. I'm excited to learn more about nature, and um, I want to like, know more like how like, to help it out. Well, I'm excited to learn about different bees and wasps. I'm excited to learn about the different like types of bees. There's like a, a lot of different species of bees. Project Exploration was founded in 1999 in an effort to bring meaningful science experiences to students who might not be the star of their science class in school, but who are curious and motivated to learn. Our goal is to open up science to those who, for various reasons, have been subtly told that they don't belong in science and that they can't be scientists. We see out-of-school time as a chance to foster relationships between students and flesh-and-blood scientists and engineers. What we know is that once young people are able to actually do science rather than just read about it, once they get to help decide what they are going to learn about, once they hear a scientist talk about where he or she came from and what they had to do to become a scientist, they begin to realize that science is for them and that the scientific community wants them, needs them, and is rooting for their success. Our framework, called the Youth Science Pathways, is, at its heart, a way for students to participate in and grow with project exploration. In a nutshell, a pathway is a set of experiences organized around a specific scientific discipline like paleontology, engineering, or environmental science. Each of these pathways is made up of three strands of programming, discover, explore, and pursue, which correspond to the growing sophistication of students' science skill and their deepening interest in specific scientific questions. This program, Environmental Adventures, for example, is an explore program in our environmental science pathway. Youth Science Pathways is also a way for us to really think about what students should be learning and to hold ourselves and our students to that. Basic science skills students will encounter include the scientific method, abstract thinking and use of models, math, observation and reflection, science vocabulary, and more. Since project exploration is about engaging the whole student, they will also work on other skills they need to be successful, including things like written and spoken communication skills, collaborating and being part of a community of practice, personal initiative and leadership skills. Together, these skills inform what students will actually do when they spend time with us. If I was not a part of Project Exploration, I wouldn't have graduated high school and I wouldn't be in college. I had no idea that I liked science as much as I do. Like, I, I'm double majoring because of them. I love coming back to support Project Exploration. Now I'm doing the Environmental Science program. I'm the teaching assistant. It helps me be a leader. So instead of sitting back and just waiting for people to tell me what to do, I have to take the initiative. Our Youth Science Pathways really is a framework that we have used to not only create and develop programs, but to help understand how a student might move throughout our programs, the kinds of programs and paths and journey that they might take as they explore and grow through project exploration. Transparency was a big piece for us. Oftentimes students did not understand what programs were available to them, especially was available to them if they wanted to continue in a particular content area, and so that was really critical. Across our three strands of programming, discover, explore, and pursue, it really helps us identify the kinds of skills and capacities that students are building at each of those levels. This summer, we just kicked off with our environmental adventures, Pollinator Ecology, which is an explore level program. It's been interesting. You learn a lot that you wouldn't really think of every day. The program is actually very fun. We all like work together, so it enhanced me and want to learn a little bit more about science. It has taught me how to work in a team with their science, how to do projects without complaining. The adults, they affected me like uh, immensely because they taught me a lot so far. It's only been like the second day, and they showed me a lot about bees and um, more about nature. Working in groups during science is way easier than working by yourself because you can consult with other people, so they've definitely helped me like understand science more. I'm the local expert in this classroom on native bees and pollinators. So my job is to help inspire students, help them engage with the environment, 
get people outside and to help these students realize they're doing real science outside. Our students are going out into restored prairies in the city and going into ornamental gardens and doing native bee surveys. We're collecting bees and the students are able to come back and pin and identify these specimens. Environmental Adventures is a welcome addition to Youth Science Pathways and exemplifies Project Exploration's core values. Keeping students at the center, doing meaningful and authentic work alongside scientists, and providing opportunities for young people to grow their science and youth development skills. Through partnerships like the one with the Chicago Hive Learning Network, we will continue to grow this program and others like it. Participation by women and people of color in science and engineering is still remarkably low. Together with our curious, energized students, we are changing that. If you are interested in learning more about project exploration, please visit our website where you can read stories written by our students and make a donation to support them. They make me like science more, like I've never been a big science fan, but now I definitely enjoy science because they make it fun. After college, I plan to have more skills in environmental science. One day I would like to come back and be a part of these programs and be the scientist that's staying up here and giving all this great information out to our students. Now, every child should join at least one time so they can have experience not only with environmental adventures, but with like, project exploration.